Hello there you guys, thank you so very much for waiting. I got Tater hooked up again. Um, I'm gonna try to avoid taking him down so no one redeem that. Um, because it took a while to get him back up. <laughs> I might low-key turn off that Peach Point Redemption. Um, but yeah, welcome back. If you guys are joining us for the first time today, we are progressing Legends Arceus story. We are about to head up Mount Coronet. And don't you dare. Um, <laughs> um confront Kamado because he seems to be kind of getting himself into a sticky situation um that we're not really we're not really wanting <laughs> so bear with me for just a second here while I manage this it's Tater there we go Tater is off for now just so I don't have to move the poor boy um and yeah welcome on in or welcome back I hope y'all had a good break um Let's go ahead, let's do this. I think we are probably not ready at all, to be very honest with you. But, you know. Only one way to find out. <laughs> the fact that people in here have said that they've had trouble. I'm gonna have trouble. He was a tater boy, and he said... Or, sorry, and he see a later boy. <laughs> I don't know where I got the said from. It wasn't a said in that sentence. Alrighty. Kiyapaz! With that 20 month recent- I don't know where Bob is, he's a little bit late to this party. My goodness. Um, it seems like stream elements might be having a bit of a time, but thank you so very much for that, I do appreciate it. What did he say here? Uh, Star for Life, I guess you could say I started from the bottom, now I'm here. <laughs> thank you for that, I hope that your day's going well. Made it back in time, you did indeed, you did indeed. Okay. Let's do this. There it is. Okay. It took a second. Bob, you're late, bud. <laughs> you're a little bit late, I'm just saying. Tater Top might come in and steal your place there. Is that the mochi man? <laughs> oh dear. Doing post game in Leaf Green. Very nice. Oh, nice mentally. I hope you enjoyed it. Still alive and kicking? Sorry about having to shutter the wallflower. I'd much rather be there now, serving up some freshly grilled potato mochi. But that Taskmaster Kamado's gone left me to oversee our food supply. He always finds a way to put even these old bones to work. While I'm handling that, I'm supposed to handle you as well. Time to get rid of you once and for all. Are you serious? I'll make myself plain. It's Kamado's right hand. I'm charged with executing all gritty deeds Kamado can't or won't do himself. I gave him my word I'd get rid of any fools that might dream of getting in the way of his plans. Besides, it's not just Kamado who longs to live in a new home free of fear or strife. His dream is mine now, too. So, okay. Kamado keeps saying that, but like, Loki. He was just going up the mountain to fix this thing. If that was the case, he wouldn't need someone down here to stop everyone else, you know what I mean? Do you know the Mochi Man? The Mochi Man? This is the man who beat my- oh, really? Okay. See my smoke bombs before, right? Well, this is how you're meant to use them. Oh. Is he about to just, like, run? <laughs> Didn't even make it further. Whoop! I like your outfit! Can I have it? When I heard you managed to quell those nobles one after another, oh, did it ever make my blood run hot and my heart pound? At last, at last! One final opponent worthy of my great ninja technique that had been left to boulder all these long years. Okay. I want his outfit, like, in its entirety, please. Oh, heck. All right. Boy, how's it going? Mochi Ninja. All right, I'm gonna hope that we can get this off first. Okay, good. Did you heal at awkward times? Okay, what's next? Gardevoir, okay. Uh, these things scare me. But you also don't like ghosts. Um, can we one-shot it though? That's the question. 
Let's see, I'm not, I don't really do the strength or agility things very often, but I might have to learn to do them. <laughs> okay. Okay, and that's returned to normal. Uh, for me, all his Pokemon were sent out at the same time? What? That sounds scary as heck. There we go. Super Saiyan, I'm doing pretty good today. How are you? Oh, that's even scarier. <laughs> Other people that do that, but this guy doesn't. Okay, so maybe you made it a little bit further? Snazzler, okay, I don't really know you all that well. Okay, that was, that's fine. Oh, that's maybe not so fine. Okay. Um, should I just sleep in today? That sounds fun. So Psychic is good for you, Extra Sensory would also be good, Bulldoze, or Mud Bomb. Let's go with Daylight. I actually don't know what this typing is though, so this might be a bad move. Yeah, Brandon, I was wondering. There we go. Poison fighting. Perfect. Seems my ninja techniques will soon be consigned to history. Yay, that was good. That was good. That was all right. Very good, young one. Very good indeed. Can I have your outfit now? It's only a foolish ninja who tries to keep after a target they know they cannot beat. You know how and to be honest, I don't I hate am. you. I might actually like you after a fashion. At least for the skill you show in battle. But listen well, Crystal. Pokemon are truly terrifying creatures. Kamado and I saw our hometown burn to the ground by mad and Pokemon running amok. We lost plenty of friends and comrades that day. Hey, Pokemon fanatic. Wait. Did Axel go off? Did I not hear him? I think I missed him. That makes me sad. <laughs> Alpha sneezed on my team. She's a queen. That Kamado came here to Hisui to try to build a new home where people could live free from fear. But to achieve something truly great, you sometimes have to take extreme actions. Did you hear him? Hmm. <laughs> Sparks, this is true. Uh, if, hypothetical as it may be, a Pokemon were to appear from within that space-time rift, Kamado might lose hold of his reason. Save Kamado from himself by force if you must. Do that and I'll stuff you full of more delicious potato motion than a human stomach can handle. That sounds like a threat. <laughs> What's the axle sound from? That is from uh, Dream Drop Distance, actually. Did you heal me? You healed me. Okay. It's from Dream Drop Distance. Um, where they're just, I think, I believe it was at least, where he's just like, yeah, they're not writing me off. Everyone likes me too much. <laughs> Death by potato much. I mean, if I want to die, I probably, you know. Potato sounds like a good way to go. But Pokemon Panic, yeah. I t um, here, at least for me, it's um, time change. And uh, I always get a little bit off. Do you got anything? Well, this is it. Have you brought everything you need? Oh, wow, you can give me more stuff? I think I'm not all right, but it'll be fine. Did you make potato mochi yesterday? Yeah, I know. You guys are a little bit at a different time than us. You've brought the red chain? Crystal, you're the only one who can stop whatever is unfolding atop the mountain. That Pokemon that's apparently been sighted through the rift. I think it may be Almighty Sinnoh, but Commander Kamado stopped us from heading towards the temple.
It was a great time for you, random, yeah. Uh, all right. I like how it says talk sense. You know we're about to beat his butt. Or he's gonna beat mine. Are you in armor? Okay. Okay. I see you. Six hour long drive? Yeah, I'll do it to you. You again. I've heard that this red chain of yours will bind the world. I assume that to bind the world means to hold the world together, keeping it as it's meant to be. A welcome idea, but can I truly put my faith in such tales? Trust me. He won't, but like, you know. What, do you think even the red chain is some trick on Crystal's part? She worked hard, worked mightily to get the thing, and I should know I was with her the whole time. I saw her rise to the trial set by the three Pokemon of the lakes. If she somehow concocted all of that on her own, then what hope do we even have anyway? Perhaps you're right. If I were to simply place my faith in this girl, that, that and that faith were to be betrayed, then how could I possibly face my people? Then work together with us. Something should go wrong. I'll take the complete responsibility. Rebecca, yeah, I think I've seen this online. I believe I, I saw this quite a while ago. That armor. Who is this guy again? The one in the picture? Because he fell from the sky. <laughs> Fine enough. Elite Four and Kellis. Oh, interesting. Let fate decide what happens next. Whichever of us is stronger will prevail. Face me with your Pokemon Crystal. Today we battle in earnest. Blood shiny shanks, that's cool. I thought he was about to fall over. <laughs> okay, so what typing are you? Oh, okay. You bought armor like that? That would actually be hella cute to run around in, Loki. <laughs> Snorlax! Oh, you're sending out a tank now? Alright. Oh, you- That was rude. Alrighty, um, I don't really think I have much for you. <laughs> Isma, do you want another chance? Want another chance, bud? Come on, you got this. <laughs> you got this. Actually, a really good job, Isma. Good job. All right, let's do it again. And because hopefully the defense is lowered, we might actually get this in two hits. Nice. Okay, so relax is down. Ow. Okay, that's fair. You did a good job, Isma. Um... Boogie, I guess. Just for the game. So again, more which may have been against Galar, like French versus the UK. It could have been. I like all the theories. Your next turn more likely to come later. I guess we'll see how we do. Okay, never mind. We good, we good. No, we found that one a while ago, actually. Um, I just needed a last team member, and people voted for uh, Toxic Crow. Oh, well that went really well, and this is actually a really good one to uh, go against Boogie. I'm just going strong style, so I can hopefully one-shot everything, by the way, if anyone's curious. I barely use that in this game. I actually forgot about it for a while.
Any Pokemon that threatens our life here must be eliminated. Saved your butt a couple times, yeah. You truly are a force to be reckoned with. surprised at how much like movement people have in suits of armor but they're actually very flexible crystal of fates have decided i concede and i apologize sincerely for doubting you commander i know i have no right to ask of ask it of you any longer but please use that strength of yours for the sake of the galaxy expedition team no for the sake of the celestica people and all the people or pokemon sorry living in hisui Don't you worry, Commander. We've got the red chain. Um, are we healed? We're healed. Okay. Let's do another save. Okay, so that went pretty smooth. I'm waiting for it to just, like, whip around and, and demolish me. I'm sure it'll- it's, it's coming up. It'll happen. Can I talk to you guys? Commander's headed for the temple, but I fear the situation's already beyond our control. Okay, so we got Cleaver and Weird Ear. Ursaluna. Can't remember your name. Basque Legion and Arcanine. Oh, that was Electrode. Sneasler, Braviary, and Avalon. Lilligan, thank you. Oh, that looks familiar, doesn't it? Just don't mind me taking a quick look around. I'm sorry, I got rid of the Bonk one for Axel because... Priorities. <laughs> and I've been threatening to get rid of the Bonk one for a while just because it was too quiet. The Day happened 3,000 years ago. AZ you fired the ultimate weapon 3,000 years ago. Were those events connected? Did it turn us in the Sword Shield Doggos get involved? So many questions. I really, like, I don't feel like we're ever going to get proper answers about that, but... I'm still not hearing Axel. Did it actually? It says it went through, but I didn't hear it. Bear with me. I heard it earlier. On or up? But yeah, okay, I'll look into that later, but as long as you guys can hear it. I went through. Was Bonk your favorite? I'll try to find a better replacement, because it was a bit quiet. Oi! Yeah, I heard that one. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna turn up Axel later, too. wonder what's happening on the other side of the space-time rift. I don't know. You can do this, Crystal. I believe in you. The moment has come. Okay, let's do it! It's time to use the red chain. Let's see what it can do. <laughs> the timing! <laughs> Hold on a sec. My head, something's talking inside my head. You hold the red train. Try to catch me then, human. Adamant, what are you saying? What do you mean, catch you? Almighty Sinnoh, I, th I think Almighty Sinnoh just spoke to me. It's telling me, hold the red train. Tr train? <laughs> red train! Try to catch me then, human, for the fight to come. Take these. Oh! I don't need, but thank you. Take my balls, Crystal, I don't need. <laughs> I mean, true. Oh, hello. I don't think I was expecting you to pop out, to be honest. Funny story about this bit. Okay, I'm excited to hear it.
Let's see what we can do here. My tear finish? Okay. What typing is this, sweetheart, again? What are you? I always forget. Boldo is strong again. Dragon Steel. Oh, okay. And then Yzma as well. Okay. Um. I saved before this, right? Pretty sure I did. I just want to make sure I don't fail. Because I, I actually have to catch it, right? Or am I just... I actually do have to catch it because it said catching, right? Yes. I don't want to knock it out by accident. I have to go through all that dialogue again. Okay. Um, well, I'm going to try a strong style. And we're just going to... We're going to touch gently. Touch. Okay, that was good. That was a really good touch. Then the game will put you into an annoying sequence before you can do it again. Oh, really? Oh. Yzma, that was actually a really good job, though. Thank you. Sorry. Poor Yzma. Yzma's just been fodder. Um... Maybe Terra? Okay. Just a little, a little tap. A little tap. I'm not even gonna strong style. So. Little tap. Little tap, little tap. Terra? I love you to pieces, sweetheart, but you are far too strong. Okay, what's this annoying sequence? Let's see. Get out of here, regroup! <laughs> Remember what I said, or what that Pokemon said to me? It said, try to catch me. If you have the strength to defeat it, sure you'll be able to catch it as well. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let me out. Let me do it. Yeah. It's time to catch the Pokemon. Are you ready to battle it? Yes. Okay, hi, sorry. That was very rude of me. <laughs> I didn't realize that. There was strength there. They need to stop. Subtitling Pokemon Cries. It just gets really awkward. That sounded nothing like that. Okay. So, tear up. Oh dear. Okay, we fine. Just a nice, gentle little bulldoze. Without having its defense down. Let's see, do I one shot you? No! Okay, good! Good, good, good. A little, little gentle, gentle. Well, gentle hits, gentle hits. Gentle- okay, we got- <laughs> Alrighty. Firmly poke it. That was a heck of a lot easier than in Brilliant Diamond. Or Shining Pearl, I guess, was my one. Heck. Dear Lord, do you guys remember that? <laughs> firmly poke it, firmly catch it. Here we go. First try. <laughs> She caught it. The red chain is shattered, but we owe the Pokemon the Lakes our thanks for getting us this far. Well done, Crystal. My girl masterfully handled. Just watching the whole time as you battle and caught your way to a simply stunning victory. You truly are the pride of the Survey Corps. It's all because she had me show her the ropes when she uh, first got here. Wait, it's happening again. I can hear Almighty Snow. No. No, it's called Dialga. My Dialga's speaking to me in my mind. It's like, you better say my name right. <laughs> Space time is torn. Awful power spills forth. The frenzied one comes to fight. Now, human, fight it with me. Tell me there's another one? <laughs> but the red chain smashed to bits. Nobody even crystal could tackle another Pokemon as strong as the last one now. I checked the Ultra Ball first go and it worked. I laughed so hard. <laughs> Can I try that on this one? Or do I have to actually fight it? Oh, here comes my one. I always went for Pearl, so. Hi! Oh, you might want to pick those up. Just saying. It's littering.
eyebrows on him. Uh, all of you, we must vacate this. Oh, forget the fancy talk. Book it! Come on, we gotta get make it back to the summit camp while we still can. We need to leave before this other almighty Senate decides it wants to fight us. But, Commander, we can't just leave it here. Yeah, yeah, dunce. You don't be any use to anyone if you die up here on this mountain. What are you waiting for? I'm telling you, we gotta get gone. Commander, or Kamado has enough eyebrows for both him and Silene. <laughs> Lucky is currently a grumpy pumpkin. Look how this tree is just... Just Pokemon in there. Uh, such a dreadful power. Certainly beyond our current capabilities to survey such a creature. I'm amazed you even managed to stay on your feet before it. Did you notice the energy pouring out of the rift? It seems likely that a buildup of the same energy is what caused the strange lightning that threw the noble Pokemon into their frenzied states. I can't believe there are really two Almighty Sinnoh after all. So that means neither of our clans is really wrong, huh? I just apologize from the bottom of my heart. So both of you as fellow leaders. You saw the truth that I could not. You never abandoned your trust in Crystal. Hi, Haru. How are you doing? And to you. I acted on ill-considered presumptions and drove you from the Galaxy Expedition Team, forcing you to great hardship alone. Despite all that, you still strove to save all of Hisui. Well, it's not like we could just sit back and ignore the space-time rift. And we understood command. Uh, and we un- Can't read. We understood, Commander, that you had reasons to act as you did. Commander, might I suggest we return to the matter at hand? We have left things in quite a state up at the temple. That's the stuff. Mr. Professor, you'd rather face what's in front of us than dwell in the past, huh? This is what I expect from a real scientist. He is back to his fancy way of speaking. <laughs> a dependable attitude indeed. Yes, let's let us move on. No need to speak any further about my rash actions, not to mention my loss of composure. Get done. <laughs> Seems that having Crystal about has been a good influence on all. Yeah, thank goodness you were here, huh? We have no chance of getting through this disaster without you. We're still not through it. How's she to keep fighting? The red chain is shattered. Relax, I've got a plan thanks to that what mighty Dialga told me. Dialga, the Pokemon that spoke to you? Yeah, and along with its name, it also told me what we need. Stone of creation's beginning. Chain of red. The vessels of humankind's invention. Connect these three and calm the chaos uh, now pervading space. And finally, Mighty Dialga said it wants to go with us back to the temple. Well, the red chain we have, at least. The pieces, anyway. I did collect them. Thank you. Hey, Andrew. I know. Same here. How are you doing today? And the vessel of humankind's invention, I dare say that might refer to a Pokeball. That's gotta be it. But what about the Stone of Creation's beginning? Leon might have some idea. He's knowledgeable about stones and minerals. He even goes digging for ore sometimes. Is that so? Then Warden Leon would be a fine resource to consult. What are your thoughts? Professor Leventon, do you have any idea what the stone could be? Hi, Ross, how are you doing? Upon my word, perhaps I do. Crystal, my girl, could you lend me those plates you received from Weirder and the others? The ones that Volo said had messages engraved upon them. As I remembered, here on the back of the Earth plate, it says, When the universe was created, its shards became this plate. I think this may be a hint to what we need. I don't really know, Rebecca. That seems very out of left field, yeah. Uh, how do you mean? Don't you see? We must research, or must search for stone, or rather ore, I suppose. It shares the same material properties as these plates. I have to believe that young Leon might know just where to find such a thing, as he said he'd been investigating it at Volo's urging. Now you mentioned that, that Volo fellows come around the Diamond Settlement and ask you about those plates before, too. Seems like a lead worth following. This aside, then, thus begins our search for the Stone of Creation's beginning. 
Although the name is rather a mouthful, wouldn't you say I propose we call it Origin Ore? <laughs> but very briefly, yeah. Irda, may we ask your clan's aid once more? Of course, I'll call Lee into the summit camp at once. I waited as long as anyone could pres or reasonably wait, but my invitation just never came. I decided to honor you with all with an unsolicited visit. Be glad and rejoice. I hate this person. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in, though. Now, Adamant, I see all these other louts have their little tasks to be getting on with. But what of the great Melly? Where's my role in all this? I'm your leader, Melly. Show a shred of respect, would you? Origin, if you will. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. Fine, whatever. Just hurry up and give me a job, great leader admin, and make it a good one. You want a job? Fine, your job is to support the others. All the other wardens are busy looking after their nobles and keeping the Pokemon... Or, <laughs> keeping the people of our clans from panicking. Take a hint. Oh, admin, you silly, foolish boy. Don't you understand anything? Everyone is work they're suited to and work they're not. And, oh, before I forget, it seems you weren't entirely useless after all, Galaxy Team Grunt. Well done, you. Yeah, this is a reward for your adorable efforts. It's my way of encouraging the little people. And you're also little compared to me. I will smack this person. Jacqueline, hello. hello. Hopefully I'm saying that name right. I hope that you're having a good day. Welcome on in. Oh, Ross, did you enjoy it? I brought Lee in. Yeesh. The ugly hat suits you as poorly as this important role does. I don't like this at all. Um, I should be the one consulted for my wisdom. Sui's ores and stones are her precious resource. Since I was the first to realize that fact, it's only natural I should be the first consulted. If you have a problem with it, perhaps you'd like to take it up with Cleaver in battle? That bumbling ball of yours? Excuse me, that bumbling ball is more than capable of zapping both you and that ugly bug of yours all the way back to your stupidly oversized tree. Shall we prove it to you now? Ellie, give it a rest and play nice with the Pearl Clan folks for once, would you? <laughs> Bigger things are at stake here. Uh... Punch the face and I don't condone violence normally. Why don't people listen? Little efforts to see you have a little god in your pocket. Was I Ross? I have no idea what I was on about, to, to be honest. That day I was really out of it. But Adamant! Everyone back home is all worked up about the fact you were spoken to by Almighty Sinnoh, or Mighty Dialga, or whatever. This is the Diamond Clan's day, be proud! Warden Leon, if you would. Certainly. Let's set out at once. We make for the, uh, prime primeval? Primeval? Primeval. Uh, grotto. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Okay. Good stuff. So, do I actually- I'm assuming I actually have to have Dialga with me? Is Dialga just hanging out in a pasture? Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait. Not yet, but yes, I want it with me. Uh, it's gonna be... <laughs> Thank you for the follow. It's just gonna be hanging out in here. That's kind of funny. Yzma, I'm sorry, sweetheart. But low-key. <laughs> but low-key. Just in case I forget. Um, because something about this is just... Hi! What are you doing? Okay. Um... I'm glad that you're enjoying the streams. So we're going down this way. Let's go get Robbie Satchel in the meantime. Uh, this way. But yeah, welcome on in. For anyone who's joining us, we are kind of progressing through late game story in uh, Legends Arceus right now. I don't know. I kind of would like to aim for finishing it today. I don't know if that's going to be actually what happens. But we're going to try our best. 
Um, but that being said, I know that there's still so much story. Um, and post game and side quests left, so like we're not finishing, finishing. <laughs> we'll still be having lots of streams in this game. Oh, there is. Okay. Oh, that was a really big landing. Hi! I haven't actually caught you yet, I don't think. Oh, you are... Uh... You are a high-level friend. You finding it difficult? It's a lot of fun, but it's very... Ow. It's very different than, like, you know, your standard Pokemon, that's for sure. Oh god, this is just a bad time. Um... Let's have you come out for a second. I just want to catch you. I just- I literally just want to catch you. I'm not even here to fight. That's all I wanted. Thank you. Well, see, I've heard, um, people listing this game along with the main gems, so. I don't know if I'd still personally say that myself, but... Okay, whoa, Rompa! <laughs> it officially is, yeah. It's a different thing to think about, but I don't really mind. I like it a lot. You can guess it's Star Wars theme quiz, but it really makes me smile. That's cute, Pepper. I'll have to check it out. There we go. Okay, and let's do a quick save. You can, Menzelin, I guess. What a curious cave. I feel some extraordinary power here, as if the world itself was created in this very place. What do you think, Leon? Um, talk, taking into consideration my knowledge of ores, my skill in mining, and the strength of my sleeves moves. I think you better leave any extraction work up to us, wouldn't you say? Gen 8.5 remix. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to stop right there. Oh, of course. Oh, come on. Who's there? We don't have any time to waste with... Clover, we haven't seen you walk or seen you since you walked out on the clan. Where have you been all this time? I don't have to tell you nothing. <laughs> Look, you can carry on digging out that treasure you're after, and then you'll give it to us. I don't know why you even look surprised. It's not as if you were hard to follow. What we seek may be as precious as treasure, but this isn't about how valuable it is. We need it to restore this awful sky to normal. Ugh, that earnest goody two-shoes act of yours is what made me leave the Pearl Clan in the first place. Enough, I don't care why any of you ran off to play Bandit, but I won't let you get in Leon's way. There are three of you and three of us. Let's go, Crystal. You take charm. Gen 1 and 3 will be the same gen, yeah. Bring good luck to my sister wherever I go, and ill luck to those who cross our paths. I'm the eldest, and I'll be your unlucky charm, especially in this battle, the battle of a lifetime. Oh, I saw that, Pepper. I saw it. Oh, wait, I probably should send out someone else for this one. Okay. Um, yeah, we're gonna send out someone else. I'm thinking either Terra. Yeah, probably Terra. 
or boogie, but let's go Terra. Find you a Fortnite. I haven't really seen enough Fortnite to really draw comparisons. Fun. It's been fun to just like begin shipping characters. We're here for it. Okay, Gengar. Um That's not nice. Don't do that. <laughs> okay. Okay, fair enough. Alrighty, um, so we could come out with Articwill and hope that we one-shot it. Let's come out with daylight. Um uh, I think a daylight chance. Daylight might get hit though. Yeah, all the Pokemon on my team have been named by chat, <laughs> so we named that one Terra. Well, you are rather formidable. Pokemon gods, please give me shiny Psyduck. I hope that you get it. Shiny Psyduck's cute. Come on, Clover. Why not come back to the Diamond Clan? Times are changing. We're changing. We could really use someone as strong as you are. Are you joking? I've got no interest in looking back in that place with all its stupid rules. Look, we'll let you keep your treasure this time, but you better do something about that sky. You're strong as ever, Crystal. Maybe you really can do something about that monstrous creature at the top of the mountain. But even if you do, the next time we meet, you won't escape without a beating. Remember that. like that mochi guy. <laughs> Honestly, those three, what did they even come here for? Oh well, I'll heal up everyone's Pokemon. A coin that I remember never hesitated to help someone in need, even if she groused as she did so. I suppose they may have been worried about us, perhaps even wanting to help. And they should have just said so. What a pain they are hiding behind all that attitude. Oh, Shady, yeah, I think a Kingdom Hearts Terra, but that's just me. I was able to extract some of that origin ore, whatever it is you wish to call it. I suppose it had better go with you. Thank you. I forgot what normal Sligu looks like. Uh, or of Mysterious Power, spoken of in Ancient Myths and said to contain the power of all of these to know itself. Oh, surprisingly easy. Now you simply fail to recognize my skill. You ought to be praising my hard work, honestly. I knew we could count on you, Leah. No wonder Cleaver recognizes you as a worthy warden. Is everything good? Oh. Sorry, Mike's, uh, one of Mike's alarms went off. <clears throat> Someone that didn't accept that Sligo actually mind that, because how could it? <laughs> I'm just like, that's fine. Um... Uh, Ross, I think technically all of them could, yeah, but it was weird. <laughs> Let's hurry back to Prof Mr. Professor and show him what we got. That Lavatin's got sound judgment plus knowledge to spare despite a silly streak. Keep on drowning your character. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, I'm being targeted, am I? I see how it is. Hey, 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 hey. Hello. I needed one of these. Is it the last one? No. <laughs> okay, there's still another one here. But to be fair, I haven't really been in this cave here. I didn't actually know these were here. Um, at least I don't think I did. Have I been here? Maybe I was here. Bear with me. 
I don't remember coming in here, but it's possible this is one of the caves we headed through at the beginning. <gasps> Wait a minute. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, wait. That's so neat. Okay, neat. I like that. Oh, this is literally all the cave is. Okay. I thought there might be more to it. Is that where you forgot your last one? <sighs> now I really want to find that last wisp, but I should probably just continue the story. Okay. Am I seriously being targeted again? Have you checked the Wayward Cave? It's probably gonna be in there, to be honest. Um, we can go back and hunt for it super, super quickly. It lets out over here. I do want to get through the story, don't worry, I'm not, like, gonna completely sidetrack, but, you know. That was not intended. Oh. There we go! <laughs> No, it's not truly open world, although apparently Scarlet and Violet will be. Um, there's loading zones between each area, but the areas are massive. Spend a lot of time in one area without needing to, uh... Um, leave. <laughs> okay, so not here. Caught a whole lot of nothing, random. Do you guys know whereabouts it would be? Oh! That scared the crap out of me. I was just going for the iron. It is very dark on stream. You're the alpha crowbat. Okay, thank you. I do remember that. <laughs> I think I remember running from it. No, mm, Sneezler. How are we? We'll see you later. Thank you so much for stopping by. Sneezler. I'm just trying to get the alpha chunk. There we go. Alpha chunk? The uh, iron chunk. Sneezler, this is not about you. <laughs> Would it be in here somewhere? Is the chance I've already got it? Maybe? Because I remember running past this thing. It was hectic, but I did it. I'm just start throwing Pokemon because it'll be less Sneasler action. I've already got this one, you guys. Um, I haven't seen anything that looks like it. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We will find the last ones eventually. Um, let's go up this way. Save. 
So this is the stone of creation's beginning, the origin ore. Yes, one can certainly feel an imposing aura emanating from it. Could this be the feeling of the very origin itself? I've been meaning to ask since you brought that up, but the origin of what exactly? Of everything, by the sound of it. Exactly, my girl. Now then, back we go to Jubilee Village. Can I change? Oh, Ross, I wasn't making it turn. That's the thing. It was going on its own. <laughs> Here you are, Professor Labinton. What remains of the red chain, broken as it may be. Splendid, even in pieces. I think we'll find it still perfectly fit for a purpose. We're jolly lucky you had the foresight to pick up these broken bits back at the temple. You're up next, Crystal. Time for, uh, whatever we're calling that stone. <laughs> Meanwhile, Rowlet. <laughs> uh, you handed over the origin ore. Fragments of the red chain collected at great personal risk by the Pearl Clan. The stone of creation's beginning, which we first learned of thanks to the Diamond Clan. Now it's time for the Galaxy team to play its part and turn these items into a proper vessel. Ray, my boy, you're one of our team's greatest craftspeople. Could I ask you to do the honors? Just wait, Crystal. You'll finally see what I'm truly capable of. In 14 days, Kingdom Hearts turns 20. Yep. Yep. This may take us some time. Perhaps the rest of you are the best way outside while we work. Come on, Mr. Professor. Wish they'd hurry it up in there. I'm starting to suspect all of your prattling about the value of time is a cover for your own impatience. Now I feel old. <laughs> Is sitting back and waiting actually solve things? I'd sit forever because that'd be using time well, unlike this. We've done it, Crystal. It's complete. Did I not spell unknown correctly? My bad. I think I uh, may have had it autocorrect to that as well. <laughs> Go do another Kingdom Hearts turn to celebrate. I really want to do another one, like another series playthrough when. Um, the Steam, or sorry, Switch version came out. But then that was a huge flop. I might just low-key play through the series again, just for funsies. Um, at some point. I don't know when. We'll see. I dub it the Origin Ball. If the message conveyed to our good clan leader can be delivered, then this should allow you to catch the Pokemon that's appeared at the Temple of Sinnoh. Hi, yes. <laughs> Thank you, Rando. Oh, wow, that's really cool looking. I like it. My fingers are going through it, but we're not going to talk about that. Be fun at Miss Kingdom Hearts. Do it. <laughs> um. Yeah, because I had to use my phone to set that because, um, uh, the the icons. <laughs> um. I'm not against it. We could make that after maybe after Kirby and um. Uh, Rune Factory, we can we can look into another Kingdom Hearts playthrough, just the entire thing. Not for YouTube, just for us. <laughs> Wait, really? Yeah, I'm not against it. You guys know I love me and my Kingdom Hearts, and I get to see Axel again. So, you know, look cute, just, I'm fine. Can someone, can I play this thing? Do you know how popular I am? He's very popular. <laughs> Eventually cherished ball, yeah. Just Adam as well. Heck, it deserves a cute red ball to match. I didn't know about this. Thank you, know you how popular I am? So popular. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna have to go through Chain of Memories again, but... Um... I think we are expecting something this year for the 20th anniversary. I don't know what it's going to be. I personally, personally. Okay, listen, can we share for a second? No cooldown on it. No. <laughs> um, can I um, share my hopes and dreams for... Yeah, Pepper, that sounds fun. Um, for Kingdom Hearts 20th anniversary. A lot of people, if you guys look into the Kingdom Hearts modding community, now that they're on PC. 
people have been modding Kingdom Hearts 1 to run with the Kingdom Hearts 3 graphics and engine. They've been, like, recreating Traverse Town and stuff like that. Guys. <laughs> Guys. If they went back and just went over Kingdom Hearts 1, at least, at least, I love 2, but, like, 1 is a little bit, you know, it's a little dated these days. Um, and gave it some of that, like, charm and luck at Kingdom Hearts 3. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'd be happy. Um, Kingdom Hearts 2 as well, but don't touch the gameplay in 2. Don't touch it. It's perfect. Um, you can touch 1, though. <laughs> 1 is, is not, you know. I think they're doing it for Kingdom Hearts 2 again. Yeah, I just seen Traverse Town, so I thought it was cool, but... We'd never see Crystal again. Yeah, I just... I would become a Kingdom Hearts streamer. The Pokemon? Don't know don't, what... Legend of Zelda? Who's that? Animal Crossing? Never. Just... Just, <laughs> just Kingdom Hearts. Final Fantasy? I don't, I don't know them either. Although I kind of do. Modded Kingdom Hearts. I've never done modding for that, so I don't know how it all works, but... Um... Horizon Zero Dawn's a Kingdom Hearts game, right? A singular and irreplaceable Pokeball that could be used to catch the frenzied Pokemon raging at the Temple of Sinnoh. Is this... does it... like, is it Master Ball? Kind of like, it'll catch? It'll work? Rock says level 99. These Pokeballs of yours are full of wonders. <laughs> Where's my hand button? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, to think the fate of all Hisui could rest in something so tiny. Don't judge it by its size, that's rude. Have a Kingdom Hearts emote? Tempting. <laughs> oh, that's a key item. You cannot use it elsewhere. Perfect. It's interesting how catchy a Pokemon one of those things brings the two of you closer together. Oh, hold on. It's that voice. I hear it in my head again. You mean Dialga? Yeah. It seems like my Dialga is willing to lend its strength to this fight. That's what it's telling me. Rosie, enjoy that lurk. That's certainly excellent news. The Diamond Clan's almighty Sinnoh, or perhaps I should say Dialga, is fearsomely powerful. Everything's ready now, Crystal. Take the Origin Ball and hurry back to the Temple of Sinnoh together with Dialga. Bob with a Keyblade. <laughs> or Tater with a little Keyblade in his tiny little hands. <laughs> I would love that. His own custom Keyblade. I wonder what Taters would look like. Let me flesh out his character some more. Can I change my outfit? Oh, Sorry, I got a little bit too excited about that. Oh! Well, at least they didn't empty out my house, even though they kicked me out. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Is it in my outfit? Survey Corps uniform. I kind of want to go back to default. Um, I might keep these current boots, though. Does Tater even have hands? Yes. <laughs> they are small and stubby, but I promise that you're there. <laughs> oh. Oh, right. I'm barefoot in here. Just wanted my tea I made. Lobbies haven't had it in ages for- How good this tastes, yes. Feet, not hands. They can be, they can be, hands and feet if you want. <laughs> and here you are, lost one, ready to face your fate atop Mount Coronet. Seems a vicious battle might await you. I'll go where I must. Oh, well said. Now hearken to my words, young ones. Time cannot be severed from space, nor space from time. That's why I ship it. <laughs> the being you will encounter at the Temple of Sinnoh is Palkia, ruler of all space. It's allowed to run wild, space itself will warp and bend here in Hisui, and eventually the very world may be broken. But you have the aid of its counterpart, Dialga, the ruler of time, and therein lies hope. Balance will be brought to time and space, and the world can once again be as it should. Now take Dialga at your side and make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. So, cannot, do I have to fight it? And then it catches in a cutscene, or like, how's this gonna work? If you're keeping with your dots. <laughs> I must say, this is quite the intriguing village. Perhaps I'll have a look around before I go. 
See what your clothier has on offer. Excuse me? Is this the time for shopping? Uh, well, I'll hardly have time for shopping if the world ends, will I, young man? Fair point. Alright, Crystal. Once you feel ready, set out. Make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. You can't mess it up. Not gonna suppose to surprise. Okay. Okay. As long as I can't mess it up, we good. <laughs> because it's me we're talking about. Which is I filed taxes together. <laughs> Random. <laughs> Next time I'm gonna like ask someone if they're dating someone, it's gonna be, are you do you file your taxes together? Like it's his mom. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, I feel a bit weird otherwise. So I, I guess technically they could still file their taxes together. <laughs> okay. No more ninjas coming to fight me. Thank you. Yeah, we fought Benny. I want his outfit. Just the girl I've been waiting for. Now you can buy various sundries at the base camp, but I thought it might be helpful if I sit up here closer to the temple. No, no, you're creeping up here. I don't like you. I want to have front row seats if there's a chance to see the world of myth and legend. I'll probably be creepy even closer to the action once the battle actually begins. Oh, but you don't have to worry about me. I'm perfectly capable of taking care of myself. And besides, I know all too well the strength of your, you and your Pokemon. I've got no doubt you'll have this whole thing tied up in a neat bow before I could possibly be in any danger. I don't like you. <laughs> I just don't. Clear or not. Oh, random no. <laughs> He was raised by the Gil and only found his role mom later on because he was genetically interested in her. Genetically interested in Miss, hence why he doesn't call her mom. It could be. Could be she knows, but he doesn't. But he has ideas. Oh, I see Kamado's back in that outfit. <laughs> Alrighty, Dialga. <sighs> Come here, sweetheart. Let me dodge roll up this hill like a boss. For so long, I thought I had to eliminate any outside element that might threaten the people of Jubilee Village. Whether that meant banishing you or seeking to destroy Pokemon of the temple, I felt it was my only path. You've shown me that I was wrong to think in such a way. Are you ready for this challenge? Um, yes. Yeah. As long as I can't mess it up. <laughs> hey, Crystal, let's meet tomorrow together. Oh! What's that supposed to mean? Oh, she's jelly. She's jelly. We're here for it. I ship it, though. I won't get it. I won't get in the way. <laughs> To saying we got in the Diamond Clan, it means you hope you'll both stay safe. Sorry. Most to file taxes. It's good because I need help with my taxes. Perhaps it's worth listening to what the Diamond Clan has to say sometimes as well. we'll support you in whatever way we can, though I doubt you'll need it. Crystal will protect Tasui and her people, protect time and space for her Pokemon. The noise of my glasses being moved actually picked up. These are very creaky glasses. <laughs> I don't know if that's weird to say, but... Oh, Best track in the game? I am ready. me. 
Oh, is that how it all got destroyed? Okay, okay, I see you, I see you. Putting down this lore element. Just ruined all these statues. Oh, you look terrible. <laughs> I'm not, I don't, uh, what did they, where's your arms? Are you okay? I don't know how I feel about the, these new Dialga and Palkia forms, to be honest, but like, you know. Oh, oh, yeah, this is why I said that there would probably be more. Oh! Oh, this music, though. This music's good, though. Oh, God. Okay. We good. Let me hit you in the butt. Oh. Okay, okay, we good, we good. Ooh. Ow, oh, I see you're sending out shockwaves. I didn't see that one coming. Okay, can you die? Come here, you big majestic unicorn, you. Which I guess you're not really a unicorn horse thing. I can continue this. Oh, I guess we're about to find out. I looked over. Everything went black. Okay, let's see. Should we attempt this battle again? Oh, thank goodness. Continue. Yes, please. Thank you. It's very nice of the game, to be honest. To be honest. See, this is where, like, you know, if the Switch had, um, uh, what am I thinking of here? Ooh! I had achievements. Ow. I keep getting hit. But if the Switch had achievements, there would be an achievement for not continuing, you know what I mean? For like getting it in one go. Just let me continue. Grant you a shiny center it, says anyone have a name for it? I want to name it like Walk or something. <laughs> How do I... Am I just rolling into it? How am I getting hit by that? Maybe I'm not rolling the right direction. Oh, I rolled the wrong direction. <laughs> oh, heck. Okay, don't panic, don't panic. We're fine. We're fine, except for when you roll right into something. Oh, Cookie Sense, absolutely. I have over 60 hours of gameplay and I haven't finished it yet, but I've been really, really enjoying it. We're gonna get knocked out again here. Did I just sprint out of it, you think? Instead of rolling? Oh, Rebecca, can't relate. Can't relate. Rolling does take longer? Okay. I'll try that this time around. I don't think we're really doing anything with it when it's doing that whole thing there. Oops. Oh god, how do you run again? Oh 
Oh god. Nearly there. There we go. Well, ask me if that's what needed. Yeah. That would have been helpful to know earlier, but thank you. That was actually really good. I was just so used to dodging. <laughs> I would have expected that to drop with a different thought. A little bit disappointed it didn't make the noise I thought it would. <laughs> Much better. All the music. <laughs> Automatically got better. <laughs> she she caught it. She really did it, didn't she? My eyes aren't lying, right? She actually went and caught it. Oh, yeah, good show. What a catch! It contained that fearsome thing in the origin ball. Absolutely outstanding as ever. Thanks, Sino. Just what I expect of my protege. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sniff. <laughs> So even the commander sheds a tear now and then, never thought I'd see the day. That's what a sight to have witnessed. I know the roof of the ruins just kind of... <laughs> I think it was just decimated. Ouch, what gives commander not sure I deserve a sumo throw? Well, at least it seems like this is no dream. Listen up, all of you. It's a calamity unlike any we have known. We were able to overcome it by working as one. This calls for a celebration, a festival for all of us. Gather your clans. This will be the greatest celebration Hisui has ever seen. Celebrate with the Diamond Clan? The two clans together, huh? I ship it. <laughs> well, since it turns out we're both following a true almighty sin of our own, I guess the times when we fight over uh, who was wrong or right or ancient history now. I'm sure our ancestors would be shocked to see us agree. This may as well be the best path forward, protecting the space we all share. <laughs> come on, come on, it's just like, let's party! Uh, let us celebrate for today dawns a new day for all those who live in the Hisui region. <laughs> okay, so I know that this ending is very, like, sudden, and it almost feels even- I'm assuming there might be a post credit scene, but just from this, it almost feels a little bit, like, sudden and unsatisfying? Not satisfying, maybe? But knowing that there is a lot of post-game, and there's a lot of side quests we haven't done, there's a lot of stuff we can do, uh, we're still gonna be streaming this game 100% for like the next, you know, couple weeks here. Um, we still have a lot to do. <laughs> and I did spend a lot of time trying to finish it. Um, or I should say, trying to not finish it. I spent more time shoddy hunting, I think, than anything else, but I really, really enjoyed this game. My goodness, if you guys have not already, yeah, uh, if you have not already, picked up this game and give it a try yourself, please do. My goodness. It does feel very sub- yeah. Um. It's- it's Pokemon, but it's Pokemon like you've never seen it before. It's not entirely open world. It's not graphically, maybe, as good as it could have been, but it's still really good. I- I never really let the graphics bother me. I think it actually looks quite nice. Um. And it's really, really heckin' cute, to be honest. Just running around, being able to, like, you know, actually catch Pokemon properly, and 
the fights and everything, everything's really seamless. So. Poor Ingo. Ingo is one of my new favorite characters. I still want your outfit. I want his outfit. I kind of want yours too. <laughs> Just for funsies. But yeah, as per usual, you guys, whenever we finish, I feel like it's the right word for this, whenever we finish a game, um, I always like to let the credits roll. Um, we spent, like I was saying earlier, over 60 hours in this game and we're not even done with it yet. I want to make sure that the people who actually worked on it are credited properly and we appreciate them. <laughs> Random. Um, this is a good one. And the fact that they were also working on this game alongside Scarlet and Violet, which look to be taking everything good from this game and then just running with it is just beautiful. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. Man, these are really long credits for a small indie team. Um, there's a localization, tech support, <laughs> debug. They didn't find the um, the spinning thing, which I kind of want to go show Mike that because I don't think I, I I actually forgot to show him that yesterday. But yeah. That was fun. That was that was actually very fun. I think, like, it almost feels weird to say this is a favorite Pokemon game for me. Because, it, it, like we were saying earlier, it's mainline, but it doesn't necessarily completely feel mainline. Um, oh, there's Masuda. <laughs> um, it, uh... It definitely has... It, it's high up there for me, in terms of my favorite Pokemon games. Absolutely. Oh, that's so cute! Look at everyone! <laughs> Does the boy and the girl change positions depending on who you played as in this one? I guess it would, right? That's cute. That's really cute. Your arc phone is beeping. Seek out all Pokémon. It's like, hey, did you forget? <laughs> and there you go. Prepare well, then make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. So does it just load me in? Uh, is the game broken? <laughs> I That's not where I am. I'm right here. It, I'm not there. I'm here. <laughs> hmm. What is my foot doing? Uh, let's go see. Oh, uh, Pokemon definitely rekindled from playing this game, yeah. Morning Crystal! So the space-time rift is gone. Think that means we can finally close the book on this whole mess? Well, in any case, there's one book we can't close yet. The Pokedex! Time to get back to our official survey uh, core duty of completing it. We're gonna meet in the Survey Corps office to discuss how we'll tackle the work that's left. See you there, Crystal. There we go. New Day Dawns, head to the Survey Corps office to discuss what to do next. Okay, so... Oh, in fact, don't worry about it. It's okay, I totally understand. I think... I think what I'm gonna do here is I'm actually gonna wrap up here. It's a bit early than I normally would, but I do have some stuff I need to tackle later on today. Um, reason being is we're going to continue streaming this, of course, probably maybe on Wednesday, but probably definitely next Saturday and Sunday. Um, and we're probably going to stream it actually until I get my hands on Rune Factory 5, because I'm not unfortunately getting that day one. Um, so we have a lot to do. We have a lot of Pokedex. How many Pokemon are in here? Was it 240 something? I think. So we have quite a few left. We still have Wisps. Um, there's a lot of side quests, a lot of post game that we have not done yet. 242, yeah. Um, so we gotta do that. Um, friendly reminder tomorrow, 10 a.m. Eastern. If you guys wanna drop a follow and come on back, if you're new here, um, we're gonna be playing Night in the Woods, which I'm very, very excited for. Let me see who's live. 
Let's go hang out with... Maybe we'll hang out with Kim for today? Kim's doing some Final Fantasy XIV, and I've been trying to get into that game because I really, really want to. <laughs> um, let's go hang out with Kim. Yeah, let's go see. If you guys want to copy down the raid message, that would mean the world. But thank you guys so very much for sticking around for this Legends of Arceus journey. We are not done yet, but we are done... Main story. <laughs> um, I think there's still more to do, but... Um, let me get you guys. There's the raid message. Thank you for that. Copy down that raid message. Let's get going here. Um, I'll see you all tomorrow, 10 a.m. Eastern, night in the woods. I'm excited. It's going to be a lot of reading, which today was a lot of reading, so we'll see how we do. Um, and yeah, have a good rest of your day, everyone. I'll see you all next time.